this is a question in your ncert books this is important and unique that is why i have taken this up let's see this question it says solve 2y ex upon y dx plus y minus 2x ex upon y dy is equal to 0 everywhere you see what is there not y upon x but ex upon y means x upon y x upon y everywhere so usually what do we use to substitute in homogeneous questions y is equal to vx but this time since x upon y is everywhere there let's write x upon y is equal to v that means x is equal to v y so everything will be changed and how it will be let's see so let x upon y is equal to v if x upon y is equal to v that implies x is equal to v y that is equation number one dx upon dy is equal to what now you have to carefully differentiate so first function and with respect to dy it's there into differentiation of second plus second function into differentiation of first right now we have to simply put the values in the question itself let's put in the question so it becomes 2 then what is your y your y is what your y is x upon v whatever is there just simply write it down e raised to the power x upon y is v then dx is there and everything is there okay first let me do something else let me actually make it in the form of dx upon dy so the question becomes what dx upon dy is equal to dx upon dy or simply one more thing can be done that let me leave it for you people in one step I am doing something like this wherein I am transposing it to the other side so that you people don't get confused and here it is dy now in the other step I am finding the value of dx upon dy so what is dx upon dy dx upon dy is equal to 2x e raised to the power x upon y minus y over 2y e raised to the power x upon y right this is not a negative sign this is simply a plus sign now you can just simply put the values that you have found out so this is like from equation number 1 and 2 what are you going to do you are going to put the value of dx upon dy which is v plus y dv upon dy is equal to 2 multiplied by x is vy e raised to the power x upon y is v minus y y has to remain in the form of y only divided by divided by what you can do 2y is there so 2y as it is e raised to the power x upon y is v now see what has to be done now you can simply see y getting common so y will become common and will become cancelled from everywhere here i do the further part of the solution this is v plus y dv upon dy is equal to 2v e raised to the power v minus 1 upon 2 e raised to the power v now see this plus v is there that goes to the other side becomes minus and let's take the lcm so this becomes minus v let's take the lcm here it becomes y dv upon dy is equal to 2 e raised to the power v and see this is 1 times so 2 v e raised to the power v minus 1 but this is minus 2 e raised to the power v times 2 v e raised to the power v and this gets cancelled so very easily i have made this difficult looking question into a simpler one so what is 2 e raised to the power v dv here in the form of integration and here it is minus dy upon y in the form of integration now integrating both sides it is 2 e raised to the power v which is equal to minus log y plus log c and c log m minus log n is log m upon n so it is 2 e raised to the power and what is v v is x upon y so it is x upon y is equal to log m upon n and that should be from which equation we turn this from equation number one now see this is in log you can keep it in the form of e raised to the power so as to simplify the things up or you can remain the answer as it is that is up to you and that remains the answer for this question again i'm telling you can even do what you can even turn it into exponential sign that is up to you